Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 55 of a Let's Play. The March of the ET. Sorry, my, I just took a drink, and for some reason it made my mouth extremely, um... A lot of saliva. And we took out Storm's End in the last part, and we, uh... Well, we're pretty much well on the way to absolutely dunking on these dipshits. So I'm actually going to go north. Uh, seems like everyone else has got the other way covered. I'm going to go north, and we're going to get Fellwood and Tumbleton. And probably Blackhaven. We're going to hope that they can take down all of their in the meantime. If they do, essentially, we're going to be, like, done with the Stormlands. Not today, more than likely, but uh, definitely the next session is going to, the next session is going to just have, be a, uh, you know, they're going to be gone. And more than likely, we'll be able to work on the next faction. The good thing is the Reach still exists. This means that all of the factions are still very split up, which is a lot better for us. Oh, wow. Someone of the storm... The, 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 oh, shit. The Stormlands actually beat one of my armies. Well done. I mean... This does mean that the Stormlands are probably going to last a little longer now, but... Eh, I'll be fine. We, we have enough trebs to knock this place over quickly. Right, so we'll knock this over. Um, and the Riverlands has redeclared war on us, which is a little annoying because I don't really want to be at war with the Riverlands, but since we last war with them, we've conquered a lot. So the Riverlands are probably going to be like, well, yeah, these guys are. Yeah, they're probably thinking we're a threat again. So. What are you going to do? All right, let's just get in. But, uh, I mean, the Riverlands are probably going to be left alone for now. Hopefully their forces are all over by uh, the Westlands and they leave me alone. Though I'll be honest, the likelihood of that ain't very high. Again, there is a very big player bias in the Banner Lord. To be fair, I think there's a player bias in literally any game that you can play at, like, as a player. Like, for the most part, player is just, like, considered the big enemy by the game. Like, we're the BBEG, if this was uh, used in D&D terms. I don't know why I'm actually shooting on horseback, because legitimately, like, there's no reason for me to be on horseback. This isn't like uh, other Let's Plays where being on horseback might actually level up my horse skill. Because for the first time in a long time, I... Actually, I think this might be the first time ever. I have really good... Well, not first time ever, but first time like, I don't have a dragon where my... Uh... That guy must be dead. Okay. Uh, first time where we have high athletics and high riding without having a dragon. Guy, will you just die? Thank you. I am very worried about the taking of Tumbleton now, because obviously it's the new added enemy over there. I think I might double back and take out uh, Weeping Town first, and then like leave Tumbleton as their last like you know vestige, a last like little life last lifeline uh, other than uh, you know what we've got. And yeah, that guy is lent. That guy is that dead body is so creepy. Because their eyes are open, it looks like they're... Uh, and the position they're in, it looks like they're just kind of waiting to fight again. Okay. How many have they got away? Too damn many. They're going to they're gonna easily get away 20. So let's uh, pull out, send the troops in, go from there. I did not think I'd be doing a 180 so soon, but uh, sometimes you still have to, you just have to take out the smart stuff, you know. These are the guys with one left, one well, well, one territory. Yeah, the biggest issue I'm worried about is like King's Landing, Rosby, Duskendale, and all that. But if we can get down here taken quickly. Then we'll uh, we'll have more troops up there to help.
Yeah, before I paid my troops, I should have done. I should have got rid of anyone under twenty-five. Okay, anyone under thirty then. I know there's a few, so let's just get rid of those under thirty. I did not cheapen my army as much as I was kind of hoping it would. Griffin's Roost is taken. God fucking damn it. This guy just keeps getting land. This is a problem. He needs to not have land. Ah, the Reach have declared war on me as well. Can't say I really blame them, but I'm also a little annoyed they declared war on me. We can kill off the garrison here quickly enough. We'll be good. That's four days of food. I think we've got enough time to... Okay, Duskendale's under siege. That's a problem. We may lose Duskendale. Because there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to get up there with uh, the morale I've got. I mean, shit. The, I'm not even. I'm worried that I, I might not even be able to like run this army long enough to finish this siege off. How is Duskendale doing? That's Dragonstone. Fuck. Wait, it's Dragonstone that's under siege. You cunt. That's a little bit more, more annoying. We have more than enough men to just quickly do this siege, so we're not going to actually waste our time killing off the thing. We're just going to go in. Because, well, only half the men are mine. Or half the men are in my army, so... Yippee for us. Command. All right, in we go. I don't expect him. Um, I don't actually know if Dragonstone will last, but if we lose Dragonstone, we lose it. Because right now, conquering down here is actually more important. Is we if we can get rid of Storm, uh, the Storm, uh, the Stormlands, that's more people to join us. But most importantly, more like, more importantly than like people joining us, it's the fact that we'll be able to actually, you know, we'll be a, like we'll be an enemy down, so we don't need to worry about you know how many enemies are we at war with, are we at war with too many? I mean, don't get me wrong. Once the Dornish attack is again, yeah, all of this is essentially just free real estate because you know, are we going to be able to defend it? But you never know, really. That's the problem. The good thing is we don't need Dragonstone, like as like a faction, like as a clan. Sorry, all it was really doing was bringing more money in for me while I was uh, war with these guys, uh, so I could, um, you know, essentially get ready to pay for all the lords I'm gonna have to pay for. Fuckers, just keep moving right when they need to. Go. Are we in the wall yet? These dickheads and their shields are uh, being really annoying. It'd be nice if they did have shields, but... You know, let's stop wishing it. Let's just deal with what we've got and keep going. Right. I think you guys are all dead. Oh shit, no wait, we got put oh god, we were the ones put in the corner. No, I thought we were winning because we were... Oh, no, 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 no. How many times do I have to remember? Don't go in the fucking corner. 
It's almost like my dumbass forgot Dogo in the corner. Oh well. You you live and you learn, as they say. Too many people are running away, so we're gonna have to uh, send the troops in again. All these asshole people. I will keep Weeping Town, I think, for now. Yeah, Weeping Town's really good. I'm gonna keep Weeping Town for now. Just because I'm probably going to lose Dragonstone, and I will need an I'll need that extra bump of influence, you know? Wait. Before I do that, kick out anyone under 25. Uh yeah, we'll we'll do we'll do Ah oh, fuck it, we'll do 30 as usual. Not be, uh, let's not try and be smart. There we go. Anybody nearby who's cheap? Yep. Six, well, no. N they're not nearby, but we will call them. Because not only are they cheap, they'll uh, make my army a lot fucking bigger. Um, yeah, I think Dragonstone's worth losing because I've got Weeping Town instead. So if we can conquer all of uh, this and Tumbleton, we're golden. Like, at that point, we've not only have we won, in a sense, like, not only have we uh, gone to the point where we've you know, beaten the, uh, these guys, we've beaten them... Ugh, you, I don't want to give it to you, but I haven't got a choice. Not only have we beaten these guys, but we'll have uh, added, you know, good, we'll have, like, exchanged some good territory. And, you know, we'll have only lost a little bit of land in the north instead of down here, where... Like, right now, I'd say losing land down here is more important, more annoying. I definitely have got enough money from the new lords that I'm gonna need. Enough influence, luckily. The times like this where I wish that piecing out didn't cost me my uh, all my influence. It does indeed make it very hard to do stuff. Holes under siege now. Fuck me. Yeah, up to the north is going to be really fucked up right now. Uh, Stone Dance, Hull. If we lose Hull, that's fine. If we lose Fellwood, that's fine. Again, losing a little up there to take out the Stormlands is okay. Because we'll be able to try and take a lot of the Stormland clans in. So after this part, after this, sorry, after this part, after this uh, siege, I'm going to check to see what, um, what lords we know of, like what clan heads we know, and how many currently are on there. Uh, a uh, crash course for joining us. I'm going to assume not many of them, but uh, again, the more we take, the better. I'm a little concerned about how many how many sieges we are losing up there, though. It's okay. I mean, we'll, we'll figure it out, uh, of course, but it's just a little annoying, you know? Now, we put the effort in to take them, and now they're getting taken from me. Now, I've got to stop aiming for the midsection, but it is the easiest place to hit. was shooting at me and I don't appreciate it. There we go. How many men are in this siege? I actually don't even know how many men the enemy has, so... I need to be very careful. It does look like this is the siege where you can climb up the walls, though, so if we do this right... Instead, if we do it right... Oh, fine, I won't even bother. No point. We just need to kill five more of them. Yeah, those little cunts are going to get away. They're all the way over there. Fuck 
fuckers. They just got away. Just barely. Oh, like, Greenstone, after, you know, choking on my, uh, my saliva there. Greenstone has been taken back for, like, the fifth time. Right. Uh, looking at kingdoms, we look at the uh, Stormlands. So, Friendly's never going to join us. Buckler might. Tarth, don't know them. Sell me, probably will. You definitely won't. You might. Don't know about the Conningtons. Don't know about you yet. It looks like the majority of these that we know of will join us. Apart from D the Dondarian for some reason. Aegon hates me as well, which is... This is shit, it's Aegon. I need to look up north to see what's happening, see what uh, potential losses we're looking at. And where. Velwood, okay, we're losing around here. So they're not taking this little piece, though. So, yeah, we'll go get we'll go get the rain house next. Wait, is that guy... I'm going to have rain, not bad. Also, again, anyone under 30 troops, we need to immediately just dismiss because we, uh, we need to leave the uh, space for people who are, uh, you know, worth a little more. Those guys. Again, even with all this shit over here, I am going to do my best to siege back Sorry, siege all the stuff I need to siege to get uh, the Stormlands on the... Uh, well, get the Stormlands in the bin. Because that will make our life a lot easier. I feel like at this point everyone knows that, but I feel like I just have to say, because it's just, you know... Well, it's just what they say in it, really. How big are my armies? That's the biggest question right now, I think. Yeah, these armies ain't the biggest that we've got. And they're taking Rook's Rest. Yeah, there's like... We have... This This is the problem, is they don't declare war on anyone else. They only declare war on who they're meant to play, who they're forced to be at war with, and that's it. And then they declare war on the player, and it just feels a little shit. Hopefully the Realm of Throne mod makers will fix this because it's just not as... It, it, like, the first time around, it's fine, but, like, after you realize that's how the game works, it gets really infuriating when you realize, like, you, the enemies could... You know, like, Stormlands could be fighting the... Well, the Reach wouldn't make sense in this case because it's but could be fighting the Riverlands and that, you know, because, you know, Overcome. why it's Bannerlord. Like, why wouldn't they fight them? But they don't. It's just a little upsetting, you know? It means I have to put up with these dickheads all all together. I mean, it does mean that we must be better, must be good at the game to be able to do it, but it's just annoying, you know? The fuck shot at me. Look at that Giscari assholes throwing stuff at me. Right, you Giscari prick. I have a bow. His militia archers may not be able to hit me, but I can hit them. Can I hit that guy? Let's see. Oh no, there's, there's, is there a fake fucking wall in his way? No, there isn't. Apparently, I just sucked at aiming. There we go. I do like when you suck at aiming and then you get a headshot. It's like, well, see, everything was justified in the end. That wasn't one of my troops. I just ran straight into an enemy troop by accident. The samurai cavalry got in my way. Oh, sorry, no, sorry, Nori cavalry got in my way. Sorry. Well, it's only sound Nori cavalry, so it's no one special.
Oh, my have arrows, so... I guess bring my own dumbass with the sword in now. Ah, bollocks. Yeah, I really don't... I'm, I'm really not good at the way of the sword, am I? Unfortunately, too many got away again. Little fuckers. Are you? You turn. <sighs> At this point, any uh, XP is worthwhile. Pillage, except give it away. I definitely think I don't have enough money for all the people I'm gonna money I'm gonna be expected to kind of throw away, but you know, on new clans. But I think we're doing all right. Let's go see quickly before I uh, move over to the last siege in this little area, uh, which has already been done. Um, means you're gonna be my next goal. We're losing this area, which is fucking annoying, and we lost them to who? The Riverlands. Hunts. Depending on how many men they've got there, I may just... Actually, no, 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 I need to do that fight so it doesn't go to the same fucking faction. Right. Alright, this siege should be easy to knock down quickly. I mean, we have the troops. It's more just about getting in the walls in here. I'm actually not going to do this siege. I want to see how well with all these troops we've got, how well we'll do. Yeah, way more losses than we should have took. Oh, well. We had the troops for a change, so I thought, why not? Right, Mistwood is taken, which means we are now... This little area down here is done. Taking fucking Rosby. I mean, King's Landing's fine, but like, I, I did not expect them to take all that so quickly. Alright, to Blackhaven next. We have too many prisoners. There we go. We no longer have too many prisoners. Let's, uh... Try and pick up just a troop or two. I got literally two. Alright, game. No need to be uh, vindictive. Fuck you. You took Felwood back. Whether I want to or not, I can't really make peace with the Stormlands. Fuck you! I was literally there. The game just did not want to give me it. Right, let's kick out everyone we can. 20, uh, 20... We'll do 35 and under for this one, because I need the extra, like, space. Oh, okay, we'll do 40 and under then, just to clear up a bit more space. There we go. Okay, so we're going to go get back hull in that then. Yeah, we're not going to really be able to keep this army alive for long. Okay, they did take Rosby good. Looks like we've got people taking back stuff, so I'm actually going to do something different. I'm going to go after that army I've just suddenly spotted. Hey, end of rage.
Good. Please siege there. You bastard. They're where they I don't know where they're going, but Okay, good. Go after Duskendale. That's even better. Also, it looks like we're not getting Dragonstone back at this rate. Unfortunately for us, Dragonstone is lost to us, which I mean I, I like lost to us owning, that is, specifically. Oh no, you're trying to siege Duskendale. Well, the next part's going to be very interesting. But until then, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel memberships if you're interested. And I'll see you on the next one. See you guys then.